Welcome to Car in 3 Minutes channel, where we delve into the latest and greatest in automotive tech. Today, we're discussing a game changer from Renault, the all electric Renault 5, the first of its kind to be equipped with a bi directional charger. This new tech is not just your regular charging system. Renault's mobility brand, Mobilize, is introducing this bi directional charger with a vehicle to grid, B2G, service, set to launch in France and Germany in 2024. What makes this so special? Well, this V2G-capable charging station can feed electricity back into the grid when needed. Renault is promoting its own Mobilize Powerbox charger for this purpose. The power of the bi-directional terminal ranges from 7 to 22 kilowatts, developed by Software Republic and Ioteca. This charger, through its connection with the car and cloud, can discern when to recharge the battery or send power back to the grid, depending on battery charging needs, domestic needs, and incentives from the energy market and power grid. But the innovation doesn't stop there. The Renault 5's onboard power management software ensures constant access to the mobilized V2G service while also conserving battery power. It can even power up your home appliances through an adapter that connects to the vehicle's charging socket, providing the same amount of energy as a standard 230-volt socket. To facilitate this new system, Mobilize is also launching a smartphone app, which allows users to program the bi-directional charging process. Drivers can input their desired battery level and specify when they'll next use the vehicle. In an exciting partnership with the Mobility House, Mobilize offers a competitively priced, carbon-neutral electricity contract. This collaboration enables electricity to be re-injected back into your home or even sold back to the grid, cutting the cost of charging by half on average. So, what do you think about the Renault 5 and its bi-direction charging system? Would you consider getting one for yourself? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and consider subscribing for more updates on the latest in automotive tech.